Welcome back. So the question is a vector has both magnitude and direction. Does it mean anything that magnitude and direction is necessarily a vector? The rotation of a body can be specified by the direction of um, the axis of rotation and the angle of rotation about the axis. Does it, that make any rotation a vector? So let us uh, move into the solutions. The main condition for a physical quantity to be a vector is that it should uh, the law it should follow abide by the law of vector addition also the vector has both in direction and magnitude but these are not sufficient condition for example current has both magnitude and direction but it is a scalar quantity at as it does not follow the law of vector addition rotation is not a vector on a large basis as it is measured by an angle which follows the law of scalar addition 